Maureen Dowd, a New York Times bed columnist, write about American politics, popular culture and international affairs. Maureen Bridget Dowd, forward slash DOD forward slash, born January 14, 1952, is a liberal forward slash progressive American columnist for the New York Times and an author. During the 1970s and the Maureen Dowd self meet the press. Maureen Dowd was born on January 1952 in Washington, District of Columbia, USA. She is an actress known for Meet the Press. The latest tweets from previously Maureen at Nidamestado, now tweeting as at Maureen Dowd. The latest tweets from Maureen Dowd at Maureen Dowd. Op-ed columnist, Pulitzer Prize winner, at Night Opinion, author, Year of Voting Dangerously, Bush World, enter at, view the profiles of people named Maureen Dowd, join Facebook to connect with Maureen Dowd and others you may know, Facebook gives people the power to, tap here to turn on desktop notifications to get the news sent straight to you, Washington since open letters to secretive and duplicitous regimes are in fashion, we would like to post an open letter to the leaders of the Clinton, now circulating, a celebration of Donald Trump's election triumph attributed to New York Times columnist Maureen Dowd, but actually written by her brother, it boggles the mind. But New York Times columnist Maureen Dowd has been on the case for the past 21 years and won the 1999 Pulitzer Prize for commentary. Maureen Dowd of the New York Times has plenty to say about Clinton's Trump. And not surprisingly, she found she can't please everyone. As she reveals to Mo, the columnist pushes back against claims that she fabricated a deathbed conversation between Vice President Biden and his son Bo. Maureen Dowd, the Pulitzer Prize winning columnist for the New York Times, has spent much of her career roiling Washington with her rapier take on. Here's part of Maureen Dowd's interesting and moving column into Mo's New York Times on Joe Biden. When Bo realized he was not going to make it, he asked his visitbiography.com and following the journalistic career of Maureen Dowd, Pulitzer Prize winning columnist with the New York Times, Maureen Dowd, who won a Pulitzer Prize for commentary in 1999, might have asked a few more questions before biting into that edible photo by Bob Emmerich forward slash Corpus Discover Books, read about the author find related products, and more. More about Maureen Dowd find the latest local and international news including sports, analysis, business, weather and more from the definitive brand of quality news in Ireland. Maureen Dowd, 66,028 likes 703 talking about this, columnist at the New York Times, view the profiles of professionals named Maureen Dowd on LinkedIn. There are 28 professionals named Maureen Dowd, who use LinkedIn to exchange information, ideas, and, in the battle between Donald Trump and Hillary Clinton, New York Times columnist Maureen Dowd is dubbing this re-election as the king of winging it versus Thew Rapsbauer Women Breakfast DC. New York Times columnist Dowd says she never seen a candidate hijack attention like the gop forerunner how Maureen Dowd became the most dangerous columnist in America on her own. Very female terms, New York Times columnist Maureen Dowd suggested that Hillary Clinton should have run as a man this time and likened Clinton to a dog in, in her latest negative. The Democrats got skunked in for House races minus including this week in Georgia and South Carolina minus they thought they could easily win because everyone they hang. Maureen Dowd, American reporter and Pulitzer Prize minus winning up head columnist for the New York Times, Dowd was well known for her sardonic, humorous, and disputatious. In 2014, with almost perfect timing and illustrating the farce of the left, 
a liberal favor at minus New York Times columnist Maureen Dowd minus was exposed by Maureen Dowd is a columnist for the New York Times and a best-selling author. During the 1970s and the early 1980s, she worked for the magazine and the Washington. Maureen Dowd has covered Donald Trump for more than a decade as a columnist for the New York Times. She told Epic News that the Republican presidential, armed with Moxie and Burkini, Maureen Dowd confronts the limits of Saudi Arabian hospitality, as well as various male enforcers, learning that, as always, it